Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. So, for today's video, I've got something very exciting. I have picked up five full outfits from the Pretty Little Thing X Little Mix collaboration. They've released the most insane collection. But some of the pieces are just really extravagant. Like, I love all of the designs. I'm not a huge fan of the animal print, if I'm honest. I think it's quite overdone now. I don't know. I just am not feeling it anymore. Like, other people can pull it off. I'm just, like, not one for like full animal print outfits but most of the collection i'd say like 85 percent of it i like i'm obsessed with and i love the designs i think they look amazing however i thought i would get five outfits to see how wearable this collection is for the average human i really think i'm going to embarrass myself to be honest because there's like pvc involved there's satin oriental attire that i love yeah, weird cuts and stuff. Like, I absolutely love it. Like, I'm not slating the yeah. collection at all because I think it's so sick. Like, I absolutely like love it. Like yeah, it. I'm just thinking, can I wear this out? Like, even for a night out, like, is it too much? Mm. Like, satin oriental bandeau dress. That's what I'm thinking. Like, is that too much? Like, I know, obviously, some, some things here and there, like, I can get a bit more dressed up, but, like, it's very rare when I do. So I don't know if this is wearable for, like, the average night out or, like, an event or anything. There is one outfit that I definitely you know i'm gonna love if it fits me nicely like i know i'm gonna love it because it's more up my street like, like a match matchy matchy suit but the rest of it is just quite a bit extravagant so let's go what? so i have a lot to say about this first outfit um i like the cut of the dress yeah because i think it's so different let me just let me just get on the sofa oh, look it's like such a different cut it's just so short. Like, who can actually wear this out and be comfortable, not show any ass cheek? Like, I just don't know. Like, I absolutely love the, like, colours. I love the colours they've used. Like, just very, like, gold. It just looks, yeah, very high quality, high class. But the zip won't go up. That's one and thing. Like, and, like, look. It. it fits. Yeah, look. Like, pyjamas. And it just physically won't go. Like, we all three of us had our hands. Yeah, we were like this. And it's just like the zip is just really bad and it's happened before which is kind of annoying and also there's this huge chunklet where is it i don't know where it is it's on the front somewhere there's a huge chunk of um oh, I think it's yeah there a bit, but yeah. Uh, there was like a huge a chunk of material that was like hanging off the threads were all out it was just a bit of a mess so although like the actual quality of it is thick and like the design's like really intricate the actual like way that it's made isn't great which is kind of annoying because i was really expecting high things from this however the two accessories Amazing. are like wearable like if you're wearing like a little black dress and Why you had the headband and the just going out with jeans and a plain top that would just make an outfit yeah it's, it's like, like the state this is the statement like for, an, for like for the average person who's not a celebrity the statement would be the headband and the bag maybe together or like separately if you know what i mean like yeah. if you had a plain outfit um, headbands are like sort of in at the minute, aren't they? As well, like, this reminds me of being like a young little schoolgirl. I like it. If you know I what I mean? You know how I love stuff that keeps my like hair out my face. Yeah, this bag is just my favourite. It's like the little um, white PLT one everyone had a few um, months ago, but it's actually got two handles, which is a lot more convenient than the one handle. Um, and you could fit, I'd say, in there, phone, keys, purse. You know, yep. so it would be perfect for a night out. So yeah, I really like this overall it's just a shame that the actual zip won't work yeah. and function properly that's a bit of an annoyance and that i don't know whether the shortness is very practical because you no, can literally like, it's something like it looks nice on but you wouldn't feel comfortable going out in that like, yeah think... it's literally just if you were go even for dinner though like i don't think i could sit down and be comfortable in this for like a nice dinner say it was like a really posh oh, yeah. event or something i wouldn't even be able to like sit yeah. down without my tits falling out like this it's just not practical, so yeah, kind of a shame, but I do still love like the pattern. The pattern. Really nice. Moving on to the neck. Wow. wow. Oh, I love it. Uh oh, this is a problem. So this is the outfit that Leanne is wearing in all of the PLT photos. And this is like the th something that I'd actually like pick up and put in my basket just normally, I feel, because um, I love like a full yeah. suit. And I feel like even though these are slightly too long, heels. like I'll be wearing heels with this, if anything, even if chun even chunky trainers have given me a bit of a yeah. boost. But yeah, this is obviously the most wearable, I think, out of the entire collection, purely because the color's like very toned down, like minimal. 
Um, you could wear each of the pieces individually, yeah. and like you could wear this bralette with like a skirt, yeah. other trousers. Same with the blazer, like you can wear the blazer with pretty much anything yeah. because of its colour. And then the trousers again, like, oh, I just, I love oh, it all together as well. So nice. It looks so good. The blazer and the trousers are slightly more oversized, which is quite the look that I think they were going for. Like, I don't yeah. think it's badly done at all. And I'm also glad that they did have a piece in their collection that is more wearable for the average. Like, yeah. you know what I mean? Like, it's not all crazy. Yeah, like, this level yeah, all of it. yeah, exactly. <laughs> Um, and if you're a fan of Little Mix and you wanted to support them and buy something from the collection that you think you could actually wear, I definitely think one of these would probably be the most suitable. Yeah. Let me just get me... Wow. Maybe I'll take this off just so you can see what it looks like. Mm. This is what the bralette looks like. It's sort of just... I don't know, it matches the... What are these? Are these like laces? Laces, yeah, I guess. They're sort of like laces, like hook and eye details on the trousers, but it's actually a zip at the side, like you don't fasten it from the front. Yeah. And then it's like basically like a bra on the back of these. It's got a button, yeah. so you could even, you could put like a different bralette underneath or a bodysuit yeah. or something if you wanted this done up. You could go naked <laughs> if you're really feeling it. I don't know, I just, this is a 10 out of 10 for me, yeah. purely because everything fits nicely, exactly how I'd want it to. And I feel like I could walk in the street without feeling and like uncomfortable. Perfect. Yeah, perfect, yeah. This is like a nice, smart, casual look, but it could also be dressed up. Yeah. Very versatile little outfit. So big thumbs up to this one. Um, Favorite so far of the two. Ooh. Right. I like it. So. Outfit number three is something I thought I was going to despise, but I actually prefer it more than the first one just because it's actually fit me. That's a good thing. I Secondly, like it. it's like quite a nice Look. fit. Like it's more wearable than I thought it was going to be. Like it's really elasticated. Um, so it like fit right over my bum in the nicest way. I don't think I'd be wearing it to a night out. It's more like Halloween for the average person to wear this. But yeah, I don't know. I just didn't think this was going to be nice. I quite like how the sleeves are like a bit more puffy at the top. Like it's just quite interesting design. Um, but yeah, I just don't know how I would wear this to something and feel nice and like comfortable. I feel really out of my comfort zone, but I'd much rather wear this than the first one purely because it actually fits like to my body. <laughs> what was the first one? The one that doesn't fit. Oh, yeah. I like try we tried to put it up again but like it just wasn't with the material. I'd give it a seven out of ten. Yeah. But maybe like a five out of ten for wearability. Yeah. If you know what I mean? Because it could you could incorporate it into like a fancy dress like Halloween themed. Next outfit. So, outfit number four is wow. this. Um, I think Jessie's modeling this in the photos. And I was like, wow, she looks amazing. Obviously this is quite a booby one. Um, but yeah, it's all glittery. Like there's literal diamantes everywhere. And um, got a silver buckle at the front and a, just a normal black strap at the back. Gonna get on the sofa again. Matching, we've got black cargo trousers, which I think if I was cool enough, I would keep. Yeah. Because they look fucking sick. They look better as a set rather yeah. than if I just wore these on their own. I think it'd be like, what? is it tacky? Like, I'm not yeah. really sure. But yeah, these pockets are fully functioning. You can whack your phone, your keys, your cards, anything you want in there. So that's quite good. And they're quite deep pockets. So if you wanted to wear them out and to use them <laughs> to their full advantage, <laughs> then you can. But this has like quite a weird, um, strap thing at the back that hat's just tied up for me. However, it is very sturdy when it's actually put into place. Um, again, I'm not sure how comfortable I would feel going out in this because it's just very like, whoa, at the top. Maybe if I had a jacket on, I would feel probably the most comfortable out of all of them because it's less, if you know what I mean? Because yeah. Yeah. it's black and I just don't, I've never like worn anything like this out anywhere, if you know what I mean, like cargo trousers and <laughs> heels, I don't know. Yeah. With the with this bra, I feel like I definitely have to have something on as a jacket or a blazer or something. A black blazer would look quite nice. Yeah. Especially for winter, like obviously it's not very winter appropriate. Again, this would look good as like an outfit as well, I feel. I think the joggers are the most wearable out of the two, for sure. I don't know how to rate the outfit. Yeah, I just, Bottom half, I feel like so comfortable. Like the the quality of the joggers are so like thick. Like you feel, feel, think they were more expensive. Yeah, nice and high waisted and like elasticated at the top as well. So they like 
yeah. go in. Top thing, no, I would never wear it out. Like, I just don't think I'm confident having that much boob out yeah. in public. Like, yeah. I don't have any, I don't see anything wrong with it on other people, but I just personally wouldn't feel comfortable in it. Yeah. Um, and I just don't think the average person would go to put this on. But I'm not saying you can't, you. yeah. Like, yeah, it's kind of a weird thing to release this time of year, but I guess it's like, w like sparkly winter, mm -hmm. Christmassy vibes. Outfit number five next. Right. <laughs> Hello. Outfit oh. number five. <laughs> She's on those Instagram with her. <gasps> what the fuck is this on me? <laughs> like, sorry. How do they make this look good? Like Meg just said, she made a really good point on camera that all of this stuff is good for on stage. Even, this isn't really on stage either. I don't really know where I would wear this. Like, it's annoying because I love the designs. Like, I think it's really good. Like, the quality of this is really, really good. It's like thick, like, like very well designed. And like, I quite like this slit, even though it's like not appropriate for going out anywhere really. Cause look, yeah, the skirt sort of like droops and it's like, yeah, it's just a bit loose and a bit weird. But yeah, I actually really love like how nice the red and gold look. Like it's perfect for mm -hmm. Christmas, but yeah. also what you wouldn't wear this to a Christmas party. Mm -hmm. I don't just don't know if it's wearable for a normal human mm -hmm. that's not a celebrity on stage, you know? Yeah. Like if anyone can help me out here, like what would I be able to wear this to and not look or feel awkward or no one else would judge me for? Not that I care. Yeah. But like well, also, well. do you know what I mean? Like if you saw someone rock up to this in in a nightclub, you'd be a bit like, oh. That's Apart different. Dinner, like dinner. Yeah, yeah, like I wouldn't be able to wear this for dinner because that's date too night. much. Date oh. night, too much. Like for me personally, this is just my personal opinion. Mm -hmm. I but like it's nothing against the collection because I actually do love the pieces. It's just I yeah. just don't think they're wearable for normal humans. Normal yeah. human, yeah. average humans. I'm not saying the little mix aren't normal. Yeah. I'm just saying that they live a celebrity lifestyle and that they can wear these crazy wacky outfits because they're sort of like told to or can and it's just normal. <laughs> but yeah, I just don't know how I feel about them. Oh God. Like, come on. Come on. This. It makes my hair look blonder. That's, yeah, a, good, so that's a good sign. I don't know, if the right person was wearing it that wasn't me just because it's not my style, I would probably give this like a nine because I do really love the yeah. colours, like the design and like, it is different with the whole like high neck, but it's just not me. Wearability, I think quite low, like yeah. four. Um, yeah, there's loads of other pieces in the collection. Like this is only five outfits. I've just been honest about how I felt towards them. No offense to anyone, especially Little Mix because I fucking love them. And I also don't have a problem with Pretty Little Thing either. Just some of the quality of the items I do think need to be improved. And considering it is like a big collection with like a mm. celebrities, you know. They've thought it, but little bit thought it out well. Yeah, yeah. they've definitely thought it, it out represents well. Them. Yeah, yeah. But like I can see. Yeah, I just feel like all of the pieces are very. Like I feel like this is very jade. Yeah. Do I mean, yeah. all the oriental stuff's very jade. Like I see her and all that sort of stuff. Then the cargo joggers and bralettes. There's like loads of variations that are very Jesse. I feel. Um, but yeah, I don't know. I just personally don't think the collection is that wearable for someone who goes about a normal day to day life. Especially me. I'm a uni student, and I just don't see me being able to incorporate this <laughs> into my lifestyle. Like, although I've been, I go to like a couple of events here and there as well with all my like blogging and social media stuff. I don't feel Even physically then, I can't wear yeah. this out. I just, I just don't know. I just don't know where I would physically wear this and yeah. feel like it was normal. But yeah, there are so many other pieces in the collection. I really like the whole denim range. I sh probably should have picked one of those up because that was like amazing. It's all like dark denim, thigh high denim boots. Yeah. I was like, oh my God. And there's also like thigh highs that go with like all the pieces. So there's like orient, like imagine me with this and then the thigh highs of these. And they're like stiletto. Yeah. They've it would just got, be ridiculous. They've got thigh high denim montes. They match the bra. Yeah, they're a hundred pounds. <laughs> but yeah, I hope you enjoyed this little honest review of the Little Mix collection. Make sure to hit the thumbs up if you want me to test some more collections in the future that are like celebrity specific or like a collaboration with another blogger. I've done a few before, so I'll leave them down below. Thank you for watching and I'll see you soon. Bye.